Hello guys, uh, today I'm going to introduce you uh, one of my favorite Korean snack. Okay, I, this is called, so the word you see is actually Korean word, the everything here. Um, but here is English word. This is uh, basically, uh, basically chicken, a Korean style chicken um, flavor uh, chips. That's what it is. So chip is just uh, wheat-based chips, but the flavor is actually full of uh, uh, fried chicken, um, Korean-style fried chicken. All right. So uh, how what what this uh, snack is called is here, B B A D A C K. So uh, this is basically uh, same pronunciation on uh, the Korean word. We don't have this word in English or in Korean word at all. Uh, I'm gonna just show you uh, uh, show you how to say it. It's a ba ta ba ta. Uh, this is what it says in Korean word here. This is definitely different from uh, Japanese word and then Chinese word, right? So what it says is here, this is basically, basically we don't have a word for uh, ba dak in Korean. Uh, this is abbreviation as uh, basak, basak, meaning, so ba is coming from basak, which is crispy. So ba, abbreviation of uh, basak, which is uh, crispy. And then actually this is the word uh, dak, dak meaning uh, chicken. So easy, right? So as you know, it's uh, uh, crispy chicken and there's one more, chips. So crispy chicken ch chips. So name defines everything, right? And then this looks like a little bit of uh, antique design. Yeah, it's nothing special, but uh, it actually shows like a big letter uh, crispy chicken chips. And uh, in case of there are so many uh, imitate imitation, uh, this is made by this brand. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce it in English, but it's uh, Hete in Korean word. Hete. So this is a, a well-known brand in Korea uh, who make the uh, really good chips uh, for a long time. Now, uh, as you can see, this my hands are not too big, but uh, this is like not quite big as you think. So this is only contains 60 grams. So 60 grams. So this is just uh, just small chips, right? Maybe they have a, a you know like a family size version of it. But uh, right now the regular version is only 60 gram. So it's not too much. And yes. Um, all right. So what's in there is actually there's at the back. And this is all Korean word. All uh, ingredient, all the Korean word. However, if you are living in the North uh, America, Canada, or USA, there's just some sticker and it shows uh, ingredient in English. So I'm gonna read it for you. So nutrition fact. So it has wheat flour. Okay, so this is wheat flour, not potato chips or the uh, um, the the uh, corn chips. Okay and uh, palm oil so a lot of uh, uh, asian uh, snacks uses palm oil yeah it's easy to get and there's a corn oil and there's a one chemical which is tocopherols i don't know what that is sugar cheddar cheese powder all right so there is a cheddar cheese uh, milk ingredients salt wheat starch artificial uh, flavor in this case chicken uh, whey, pro whey powder, whey powder, whoa, okay, so yeah, that's good, and soy lexitin, so uh, other than this one, in Korean it says, in this side, where the uh, Korean word is also says, there are uh, chicken extracts, so it is actually chicken extracts in there, so basically, if you hear everything about these chips, this reminds me, like, it's like a imi imitate about Korean style fried chicken in the chips, basically. 
So um, why is it so uh, popular? I mean, if you know the Korean culture, a lot of people are talking about Korean style fried chicken and beer, which is called chi mek, you know? So why is it so popular? Uh, you can get fried chicken anywhere in the world, right? But uh, I think the only difference is that if you uh, take a look at the uh, KFC, for example, uh, it's it's a fried chicken. However, uh, it's kind of soggy and salty, and then you don't get too much <clears throat> crispy uh, from the skin. <clears throat> they have a crispy style and original style. However, um, I don't think it's a quite crispy as much as uh, Korean style crispy chicken. So um, they uh, Korean chicken have a different better style. So uh, they have a different style of uh, tasting uh, for the uh, for the uh, for the outside, so that it makes more crispy and tastes good too, and not too salty. <clears throat> and then that's why Korean uh, chicken is actually really tasty. So even for me, every time I go uh, from I live in Canada, so every time I go to Korea. One thing I don't forget to um, taste is actually uh, Korean fried chicken. There are so many Korean fried chicken brand in Korea, so I cannot tell you uh, like what is good, what is not good. There are so many differences, like different branded brand. So um, yeah, if you know this one, definitely uh, you have some kind of like homesick of, I want to feel like, you know, like, uh, I want to have a Korean chicken. Then, uh, well, if you're in the, uh, if you're lucky and living in a city, sure, there are many um, actual Korean brand uh, came into the uh, North America, right? BBQ, and then there's a local Korean chicken brand as well. But uh, in case of your outer, you know, like a, uh, not urban area, like, a, like, a, you know, like a countryside you don't get to see those uh, uh korean uh, fried korean i mean korean chicken brand over there uh, that's why i love these chips because sometimes i want to uh, feel like or taste like uh, korean chicken and there's none uh, but as soon as you pop out these chips and then smell it definitely uh there is definitely a, a korean chicken taste here um in this specific um, chips, we have, it says, oh, there is a brand name. There is a, we have a franchise called Chogatjip in Korea. Uh, it says a uh, better, uh, we got the better style from Chogatjip. So basically this is like, a, a, do the same battering uh, as, fried chicken and then make it as a chips. So basically, why not? It does, it actually has to, I mean, it has to take, taste like a chicken, right? All right, so uh, I'm gonna open it. There are so many, so much uh, nitrogen in it, but, oh, by the way, the reason I'm doing this one is that um, there are many different uh, chips in, I mean, snack in Korea, however, well, if you are living in the North America, you need to get it, right? You will be able to get it. This one, you can get it from H Mart or any type of the uh, Korean uh, Mart or Korean market. Um, I'm not sure if this one actually sold by other Asian market. Uh, I'm not quite sure, but if you live a place nearby uh, H Mart, that's a Korean Mart, by the way, if you, re you didn't know that. You go if you have a chance to go to H Mart, go uh, and take a look at this one, right? It's in the snack corner, of course. Um, but uh, here's the thing because uh, you know, this is imported, right? Uh, it's not made in uh, country uh, within the country, that's why uh, the price is a little uh, pricey. Mm, I think it's a $3.99 for 60 gram. Do you? Would you pay for it? Um, I'm not quite sure about that. 
But if you are really big fan of fried Korean, Korean fried chicken taste or whatever, yeah, well, it's worth it actually. So, uh, but I do recommend it. There are many sales chains. Yeah, they are doing a lot of sales. So if you're lucky and then go there and it's on sale, then I think you can find it uh, instead of, oh, I'm saying Canadian dollars, three ninety nine. But uh, I think you can find it two, uh, below, uh, below 250, 220 something. Yeah, if it's on sale. So good luck for that. Um, yes, it is expensive. Yes, yes, I, I agree with that. Yeah, so yeah, well, I think uh, I said everything about outer side, right? Okay, so I'm gonna open it and smell it, all right? So this is right there. Okay, I'm so excited about this one. Oh, it's a thing I have to open it. Okay, maybe I should follow. There's a, okay, there's a little bit of zigzag line here. Instead of you try to open this one, yeah, it says right there. The front says arrow here. It says uh, this is where you rip it up. Okay, I'm gonna just follow it. Yeah, there you go. It's easy to do that. Okay, so I'll open it. So as you can see, uh, this is not a lot. So it's just regular, regular chips. Just small piece like that. Oh yeah, smell. Oh my God. Oh my God, this is definitely the chicken. Oh, where's my beer actually? Oh my God. You know what? I can do this all day long. Hmm. Oh my God. Oh my God. If you do the blind test with a real chicken, I think, <laughs> I think uh, people think this is actual chicken, fried chicken. Because it uh, smells like, uh, you know, like a actual, actual battered uh, fried chicken. So that's why even if it's like a chips, um, it smells like a uh, chicken, actual chicken. Very, I'm very amazed. Oh my god. So this is why, uh, this is my one of the favorite chips. Yeah, it's interesting, actually, interesting. You know, like we used to have, you know, barbecue taste, you know. It's a typical, like a salt, no salt, you know, um, like a hot, spicy. Like we have a based on, like we have so many uh, potato-based ch uh, chips and then uh, uh, corn-based chips. You know, this is like a, it's kind of fun, more fun to your uh, regular snack. It's so weird. It feels like you're eating fried chicken. So I'm going to try taste now. Um, I will shut up and then just. Of course, it's a chips and then crispy. Oh. You know what? I'm gonna just uh, pour into here. So this is everything. Um, everything I have here. So it's empty now. So it's only 60 gram. I show you. So here you go. Close a look at the uh, the just a regular shape. Shape doesn't uh. It's not actually special at all, but I can I can already tell you that uh, you know there's a pepper too. Actually, pepper, black pepper actually. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Tasty. Very tasty. Mm. I 
It's a tasty, actually. But I think uh, smells is actually better than taste. Oh my god, how did they imitate this smells? You know, I, I can tell you this one. Smells like almost 90% same as the fried chicken. Taste is actually regular chips. And then, oh, it tastes like, a, okay. Oh, okay, I can tell you. I can tell. This is like, oh, chicken taste. Oh, good. Oh, it's tasty. I'm gonna just enjoy it. Once you try to eat it, this feels like a regular um, chips with uh, chicken seasoning actually you you have a lot of uh, flavor on chicken also i have a uh, uh, black pepper um, taste at the back so which is a little spice different spice than uh you know like i'm not talking about spicy spicy there's a little bit of uh, you know back kick uh, from from your uh, throat so other than that Oh my god, this is amazing. Actually taste like a chicken? Mm. I agree some. Maybe 85%? Taste like a chicken. Smells definitely more than 90%. Oh my god. It's fun. It's fun to enjoy actually. Mm. See? And because it's only 60 gram, it's gonna end, it's gonna finish so quick. Okay. So, here is the thing. Mm, so, it's called, again, it's a Korean snack. Uh, it's called Pa Dak. Yeah, crispy chicken. Uh, tastes really good. I want you to try if you are interested in Korean snack. Hmm. If you're lucky, uh, try it when it's on sale. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to introduce you more snack in a uh, later video. All right. Thank you for watching my uh, YouTube. Thank you and see you later. Bye.